Hello dear viewers. Today, we will tell you about the life and leadership of Bayezid II, one of the important rulers of the Ottoman Empire. Bayezid II is also known as the 8th Sultan of the Ottoman Empire. The Sultan's nickname is Sultan I Bayezid. Bayezid II was born in 1447 in Greece. This region was part of the Ottoman Empire at that time. He is the son of Fatih Sultan Mehmet, one of the most important and powerful sultans of the Ottoman Empire. The mother of Bayezid II is Mukrim Hatun. Bayezid II had ten wives throughout his life. One of these wives had four children. Bayezid II has a total of nine boys and nine girls. When he was seven years old, he was sent to the Sanjak Principality of Amasya. During his tenure in Amasya, the main political events in the region were the asylum of Dolkad Kroklu al devil to the Ottomans and the destruction of Tokit by the Akayunlu forces under the command of Yusuf Kamerza. Bayezid joined the army in Kosovo in the Battle of Otlukbeli and took part in the right column. The death of Fatih Sultan Mehmed on the 3rd of May 1481 brought Bayezid and his brother Sem Sultan against each other for the throne. Bayezid had placed his son Korkit, who was in Istanbul, on the throne as a proxy for his father. The armed struggle of Sem, who considered himself more worthy of the Sultanate, led to a bloody civil war and then to an interstate problem. We will not mention the Sem Sultan incident in this video. It will be the subject of our next video. Bayezid II went to Istanbul the Sultan. As soon as he received the news of the death of his father Fatih Sultan Mehmet, his brother Sem, who was the Bey of Krom and Sanjak at the time, opposed Bayezid's Sultanate. Sem Sultan captured Bursa and declared himself Sultan. He proposed to his brother Bayezid to, to divide the empire. However, upon this proposal, Bayezid II marched against Sem Sultan in 1481. Sem Sultan, who lost the battle in Yenisei Airplane, came to Konya when he could not find the support he wanted here. He went to Cairo in 1482. Sem Sultan returned to the Ottoman lands and first tried to besiege Konya, but he could not resist Bayezid II's forces as a result of the deteriorated relations between the Mamluks. During the reign of Bayezid II, a war was fought between the Ottoman Empire and the Mamluks. The most important event of the Bayezid period was the Six-Year War with the Mamluks, the race to establish supremacy in Kukurova and over the Dolkad Kaleri Principality, and the Mamluk support for Sem brought the two states against each other. In the Ottoman Mamluk War that started in 1485, neither side could win a decisive victory. Another naval battle was fought with the Venetians. In this way, the conquest of the Peloponnese Peninsula was completed. This war paved the way for Turkish sailors to dominate the Mediterranean. Shah Ismail, who founded the Safavid state in Iran, organized a Shokulu uprising to seize eastern Anatolia. The Ottoman Empire suppressed this uprising with difficulty due to the rebellion of Hokulu. There were problems between Bayezid II and his sons regarding the administration. Bayezid II's son, Selim I Yavu Sultan Selim, who was the Sanjak Bey in Trabzon at the time, ascended the throne with the support of the Janissaries. In 1512, after handing over the throne to his son, he traveled to Dimitoka to rest, but he fell ill on the way and died. In some sources, it is rumored that he was poisoned and killed by Yavu Sultan Selim in order to secure his throne. He gave great importance to charity works during his sultanate. He was compassionate towards people, so he did not make war unless he had to. He was a religious sultan. He always treated the people in his service and his people well. In our next video, we will give information about the Sem Sultan incident, which became the external problem of the Ottoman Empire. Thank you for watching us.